Okay, uh, we back live in a second, I think. Hey. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's being weird. Uh. Like, uh, straight up. This is just being weird. Stream crush, yeah. Eh, okay. Stream end of the century, yeah. I have no clue what happened there. Like, it was running fine, like straight up. The dashboard had nothing, it just randomly decided to go offline. I have no clue what was going on there. That is really bizarre. Let me get back to the new one starts. Like, I guess that's, that's good. That, that is so bizarre. Let me talk about how the character stream ended. God, God damn it. Pain. You know what the worst part is? This is going to ruin the playlist. Ah, sad. Oh well. Oh well. Like, nothing happened there. There's no reason it should have fell off. It just did. Well, hello, hello, speed. Your game caused the game to crash. I hope you like that. I have no clue how it happened, but whatever, we'll just get back into it, I guess. Get that on the stream if a good look. Yes, yeah, sure. Thank you. Yeah, good idea, chat. There's clearly no other reason you want that. Oh, that tr that struggle by is being a bit of a pain, isn't he? Well, whatever. Oh. <laughs> I have no clue what's going on there. Like, I was just I was just on my phone and something just around said the stream ended. I wasn't given a notification or anything, it just happened. I was just kind of confused. I have. I'm just not sure anymore. Easy to say, be weird for me for some reason. Time to go against the case of Tempter. Actually, it wasn't. I was saying that, like, it is intended to encounter something, but I don't think it actually does, and I'll cover that when we get to there. I don't think it's actually a good counter thing the game trying to say is a good counter to. It's just genuinely the only thing they can actually make it seem remotely useful with. Which is fair and all, but like, it doesn't make a plan good. Pack DC moment, I have no clue. It's been whacking me, acting me all day and I don't know if it's my fault? Cause I don't think it is. But again, my internet does seem to be in bit of fritz recently and I don't quite get why. Hmm. Like to stream, yeah, maybe. I'll does you have you have those updates for free for free stream crushes, yeah, that's great. I really love that. Thank you, boss. Truly innovative game design right there. Makes you feel part of the experience. Truly the miraculous thing. Kara's a good combo of Holy Barrier, yeah. Like, Kara does some unique boss, unique, like, gimmicks and synergies. Having these synergies does not make a plan good, I don't believe in the slightest. The sliders were too strong. Dave was, Dave decided he's like, appeared to play with sliders. That's clearly what's going on here. Cause it just happen. Yeah, actually, today's been really jank for streaming. Like, I start off the stream with bloody thingy majigs not working. Like, I don't even know anymore. It's just being stupid and strange now. <laughs> Turns out it's a good combo of ho Holly, but all the is better, and it all sucks. It says our character can create infinite damage. Holly Barrier does not. 
Link and Tao Alo Canard, but our also Chaga, which is an infinite stall, so hmm. Both ones are stupid, but they're uh, kinda bad. Your opinion. I feel like intensive carrot is bad isn't an opinion, it's a provable fact. I I haven't seen any actually like good counter argument to intensive carrot being bad and bad yet at all. Because like the close people can get is that you can use it with, like chili bean as like a weak imitator. Why do you need to imitate chili bean? <laughs> Why would you want that? Anyways, here's a level gimmick. The classic. The fan favorite. We, we can't do this our plants anymore. <laughs> well, whatever. Well, we did it. <laughs> we won. <laughs> Very difficult level. Very difficult level. <laughs> What do you think of Zoybean? I don't like Zoybean very much. I can appreciate it as unique, but I don't really enjoy it. This is like a drawing of zombies fighting on a stage with a giant white hand. Interesting. Very interesting. He's Dave. I think you play video games too much. While your tongue heals, please note the strange stone tablet. It appears to be a warning sign. Written cave zombie. Does it warn people not to lick ice pickles? Wonderful. It's a rock. Yeah, it is indeed a rock. Rock and roll, baby. Woo! If on the headbird letters, it's, it's a crappy plan again. There's, there's nothing really to say. Hey, look, Rotor Bag is clung above the abyss with, with dirt around it, too, because of course there is. Brilliant. He licked a forbidden, forbidden popsicle, oh no. We don't put your own disco in the description. Yeah, this is... I'll fix up the description later. So there's a note from Dr. Zomos on the back of the stone tablet. It says... <clears throat> Hi, this is Zomos talking. I'll make this quick. Well, he's always stuck, stuck on a wormhole traffic and haven't reached the Ice Age yet. But I've noticed that you people are already taking action. So I've been beating, that's right. They are an for all humans. You are making them go extinct. How have you not realized this is history changing and you're changing it? Well, I guess I'm just gonna skip the Ice Age. You go fun there. Uh-oh. Penny, have we done goof? Hopefully not, but Dr. Zomboss does sound concerned. Well, there's a bunch of them coming at us. Let's find out then. So I must have taken Frosbuck Caves. Awesome, cool. Oh, for God's sake! <laughs> the first plant! Someone's just, you're time traveling, stop. Yeah. But to be entirely honest, I think that, like, the biggest thing to point out here is that if these are Neanderthals, then they're trying to eat brains, so they're probably not good to keep around, anyways. Like, it's probably not, it's probably a good thing they go extinct. If they are braining the animals, which they are, they clearly are. Well, whatever. I, I'm coming on PvD plot being complicated at this point, that's dumb. These other streams do be hate purple, dear. You you all a zombie from Jurassic Marsh. I'm still a firm believer in, uh, Zombies are actually aliens from space theory. So, yeah. There's another name Jave changing history. Should we don't want to see you? I mean, they're trying to freeze my plants right now. I, I feel like they would at least try to have a, have like a conventional conversation if they were not evil in some way. The fact that they're just kind of Running towards my house, defeating all my defenses against the wild, against like the object wild here. I feel like there's no way these guys are good guys. That's what I'm saying here. I think. 
Like, in what universe of these Neanderthals even remotely a good thing if reading brains? I do not know. <laughs> ah, tries to evolve entirely. God damn it. You, you, I can't just... You, I, you can't just use corn anymore. It just becomes everything. You guys are awful. Like, objectively awful at this. It's a plant chat. You don't have to go mad over it for once. The chat literally stone these people. Okay, true. That, they are just playing in character. That is fair. They certainly act that way. Why did I show up at Lightning Raid early? I, I don't know why, I seem to immediately assume I was getting to the Colonel Pulse already. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> booga booga. Culinary funny booga booga. Oh no. This is the worst timeline. Sunion Gang, yep. Apparently it is indeed Sunion. Everybody loves Stunion. It's so cool. Apparently not as much as uh, Pe 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 Colonel here. You guys seem obsessed with Colonel because you've always been obsessed with Colonel for some bloody reason. It's hard to say why, but whatever. Colonel will most likely haunt you for the rest of your life. Honestly, true. I don't see it not haunting me. It's been enough of a presence in these streams that it's all- it's just so constant. I'm gonna probably get a good DB, yeah. Strangely enough, when you get rid of a dumb instrument that nobody likes, it's actually a pretty good theme. Shocker, I know. Extension killed when. What would it even do with a Stunion cult? What is the point of a Stunion cult? Oh, that's bad. Uh, go! Uh, just to make sure we have enough breeze so these weasels don't get too far. Oh, Brodo's, because Brodo's also generally a decent counter. Ugh. That's a lot of weasels in one lane. <laughs> That's the point now, there's not really much left to do. I just stunning you. Well, good job. I think it's the best plan ever, that's a solid reason. I suppose. Hmm. Call me dear. My phone's still very noisy today, isn't it? I think noise like the entire stream. So I'm trying to warn me, I think the stream isn't working. Clearly. Well, level beaten. It's the standard of decks. 10 can they have is like nothing here. Levels are very much just kind of go. No, first time I encountered Weasel Horde, I took Reed along. Yeah, damn terribly. Yep. Yeah. Especially even in a version where like Reed does like no damage. Not right. The version where like, uh. Was it like, no, we're not. We, like, version where it's like 5 damage per hit, where weasels have like 40. So it's 8 hits from Reed to kill a weasel. That's the best part of PvZ. It's awesome. Oh dear. An ironically, comedically bad plan at that point. Funny though, I appreciate it immensely. Well. Now just have to wait for these guys to die, it's not like these guys can do anything at this point, we're... 
kind of fast deploying they can do anything in. We did it, we won. I'm sure maybe we're starting to make a comeback. He is so iconic. Yeah, not very much place for him to do so. I've done some research in the meantime and the results are in. Gulp. I, I can't make a gulp noise right now. I mean, you don't even hear that. Never mind. They are just regular Monday zombies with cosmetics. Ha! I knew it! My little plants won't hurt anything but zombies. My hypothesis is this true to all zombies in various eras, too. This boss guy really had to bring his character to play trick on us. Not cool, man. But anyways, now that's done, what's like destination, Penny? Was it quite close to home, actually? And these truly will be great hits. Could it be? Oh uh, yeah, it's more Frostbite Caves. Nyehehe. <laughs> it's always Frostbite Caves, there's nothing else but Frostbite Caves. Uh, let's go open up a piano, now let's go. Dandelion, sapling, currants. It's blowing that, okay. It genuinely no packets for any plants we actually need. <laughs> Oh well. That's just kind of a thing. Do you want to leave? Too bad, we're staying in Frostbite. Yeah. It's fine, he gets to slide more. I'm sure Dave won't mind too much. The next plan we get is also Horror Kills. So that's a good sign. It's got this Frostbite Caves? Nope. It's all Frostbite Caves. Always has been. Back in the Kill Cave. It's still as cold as when we were here. And I still can't see the temperature. Looks like a small guy felt the same. Maybe we can see those clothes. Cloths. Neither. Anyway, beam up so we have to take off the cloths. It's fierce cloths. <laughs> Unfortunately, that would not work. Those cloths aren't what they seem. They actually heat resistant cloths, so he's immune to all kinds of fire damage. But how? Probably made of a zombie boss. Probably. Ah, that makes sense now. Yeah. Ash 80 zombies, cool. So, here's the new zombie of the world. Ah. Uh, this is probably the uh, least influential zombie in the entire game. Uh, they're just dragon imps. Yeah, they're literally just dragon imps. There's like no changes towards them. They're probably the least impactful zombie in the game for that reason, but. I mean. Yes, yeah, whatever. I could probably just bring Enduring to kill him. I'll just bring Enduring to kill him, that's easy. Yeah, it's kind of cute. <laughs> Why do you think- I mean, I guess he's like a like, little, like, clothing on, I guess, but... He's not that cute. Aki, for understanding, yeah, have you not been seeing these streams? Aki is really good. It deals a lot more damage. Okay, uh, put you at the back and I'll get this going. We have Ashing Zombies is fairly annoying. It's not in the world, at least. I like Dragon Hills. I mean, it does something, but that doesn't actually mean it does good something. Uh, realistically, and this thing I kind of believe for a while, it doesn't actually change very much at all. Like, it seems like it would change more, but in reality, it just means there's one less strand for my caves you can do, which is just fire plant spam. There's just not a lot you can really do. Oh. That's probably the best, plan best call here, then. Okay. I do need to get some fire plants sorted out soon as well. Ah, crap. I probably shouldn't be letting you out yet, shouldn't I? That's probably a terrible plan. Oh, never mind, that's not a show of anyway, anyway, so it doesn't even matter very much, does it? Okay, whatever. I cannot go to the top lane right now, so I'm just gonna keep doing this. Just do that, so... Well, that's unfortunate. To put it lightly, that is really unfortunate. Well, I guess we... 
have to use that as DPS, I guess. Crap. Okay, Endurian, go back again. And the top lane's scary. Cool, 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 cool. I love this. This is so awesome. <laughs> oh well. These char guide is an absolute godsend of plans, so this doesn't really matter too much in the long run. Oh, whatever. We're getting sun now, so we can almost get stuff down and properly done. Okay, and another charge got top lane for the time being, because I am not doing a good job of dealing with my top lane. I mean, it's shipping away at these guys, so honestly it works. Okay, this defense is really not stable. Good lord almighty. Well, whatever. I am... We're doing... We're actually in a really tough situation right now because we're not doing enough ash damage, ironically enough. We probably do need to get that sorted, don't we? Hmm. Uh, okay. I'll see what I can do. Just get my staff dragons down desperately. Why do you go with this? Yeah, this is an awful deck. I forgot how bad Snapdragon is in many decks, to be honest. Oh well. You can't blame for trying, I did try and make Snapdragon work. Those, uh, wait, those mouths, I'll drag them, yeah, they are immune to, uh, fire damage, and that's kind of a decently, de decently decent part of why this level sucks, nailed it. it it's just kind of really difficult to deal with them, really. We don't really have any, many good answers to them, so, yeah, this level's kind of difficult for that reason. Uh, like, our best answer is Endurian, really. Because we also have to ash zombies to beat the objective, it's not great. I'm sure it'll be fine, there's enough. And left like weasels left, I think. Oh. <laughs> Charguard carrying this level, yeah. Charguard is incredible. I don't know if you'll ever think Charguard is ever remotely a weak plant. It is insanely good no matter where it is. It just does so much. Like, straight up, we would not be alive without Charguard right now, and I think it is a very clear fact. I'm not replacing these shotguns in my back, actually. Well, the objection complete, at least. Good, <laughs> good, yeah. See, how coded, hard coded can you make from plant seed? I actually don't know. I don't think it really matters, though, because there's not many plant seeds really want to heat that don't already heat. So, hmm. Not exactly a useful thing to change. Well, because nobody's really done it properly. Like, I can't think of any plant right now that you'd want heat that doesn't already heat. So, yeah. I mean, I guess, like, remaining cause of plants is important, but who cares, really? Well, whatever, we did it. 
Uh, Hurricane is here, and Hurricane is pretty good. So, yeah. Just watching stream, Elf. It's fine, so. It just did not warn me at all last time that the stream was gonna go down. It just kind of went down. No nerf? Oh, this thing is probably nerfed. There's no way Hurricane is a nerf. Hurricane is absurdly broken in vanilla. Oh, no. They're back. Okay. I think this one might be a uh, peapod level. Because we need DPS. I'll bring Sunny. It's Sunny's really good. It's going to bring in Durian, but we bring Durian like most levels. Snap moment, yeah. We can't escape Snapdragon, apparently. The game doesn't want us to, so that's unfortunate. However, at the very least, we have ways to make use of them, so that's something. Also, it can be frozen, so we have to heat them up, too. God damn it. But, like, no winning here, is there? Uh, that does kill, right? Okay, yeah. I was not sure there for a second. I was actually kind of concerned. But they do, so that's good. Uh, you won't. It's probably been down like a stun in here prematurely, so I can not worry about it. That does genuinely seem like a good plan. I also wrote a back here, which I don't think it does anything. <laughs> like, yeah, I can kill that zombie. There you go, it's very useful. Okay. Uh, need one more, I think. Oh, you need to in here. Cool. And a char got up top. Cool. I can do that. That also works. Maybe. No, it doesn't work. I need a dunion. Char got, char got. Okay, no, but actually the rotor bag does it. Okay. The rotor bag is range is weird, apparently, in this level. Ah. Uh, just turret kill you. Cool. Okay, there's a uh, aim gone. So, just Dunyan here. Uh, Piven, next. Heater, I guess, because we're just using things for healing now. Uh, just Dunyan, Dunyan. Chard. Oh, crap. Uh, excuse me. No, not happening. Not happening today, sir. I deplore you, or whatever is correct, fancy English that no one can actually speak. And another thing here, so if I can unfreeze that one Snapdragon. <laughs> Which hardly seems worth it, really, but I may as well have it there. Okay, now let's go to start putting some more DP DPS in these lanes. I can do that. I'm more concerned about them than that one zombie that's going to be a problem. One Snapdragon, you know what I mean. Uh, and you're pushing a... Okay, that's important to keep a note of. Troglobites can also push Sasquatchimps. That's a name. And that is not a good thing, realistically. Very important to know, though. That is very, very, very important to note. I just hope I don't randomly jam them, these guys in. Like, hey, No. Leave. There is no place for you here. I'm gonna... Okay. Nope, but the stream's still going, I think, is it? Yeah, it's still going. Again, the stream is... The, the, the dashboard is still saying that the stream is working fine. One... Earth's going on to that? I have no clue. Well, whatever. 
The stream is still claiming it is totally fine and healthy. It's never claimed that it's ever had any issues. Ever. So I guess screw us, I guess. Just have to go through it again. Just wait for it to go and finish. Ah, whatever. I have no cause causing that. It's stupid. It's dumb. We won anyways. It's fine. Shimmy Sammy is fine. Yeah. Again, no issues on that. No issues on the dashboard. It's just YouTube being YouTube, apparently. I have no clue what's causing it. Sorry. Are these maybe the boss guy as well? I'm misdiagnosed. Whatever. Indeed, they are. Fair effects on plants and zombies are interesting, to say the least. Technology into snowballs? Sure, why not? I don't mind at all. Nah, I guess one's an interesting level. Kinda, maybe. I'm mugged up, mugged up slightly, but it's fine. I didn't read the first thing because I clicked on the stream like an stream thing like an idiot. And this might be a level for you, actually. Uh, I guess I'll bring Rodo here, because Rodo can defrost itself. Cornwall, please get rid of a leg. No clue what's going on, and I don't frankly want to know. Because I don't think there's anything I can do to save it anyways. I guess I'll do. Right. So, new gimmick tie. <laughs> so this is the thing in the thumbnail, in case you're curious. This is what this actually is, so that's something. Surely wild, I know, but... This is a weird mechanic. I can save for a runner bagger. That's not a difficulty. I can save for a tray bomb, that's pretty easier. Or a tall and just tray bomb. Yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> Easy solution right there. See, I don't know what's causing it. Again, it's there's nothing actually going on. I don't know why. Like, like, like YouTube is saying that everything is fine. As well as I can tell, Streamlabs has not been saying any alerts about responding relating to quality being low. It's just decided to be weird for some reason, and God knows why. Why'd I put- I didn't mean to put you here. God damn it, I think my brain is lagging now. Sorry if I tried to sit through the live stream. Yeah, I, a lot of people have an issue. I sometimes even do that. It's just like habit, really. It's just something we have a bad habit doing these days. It's unfortunate. We're just kind of, kind of create a society where we have low attention spans because that's just optimal. It's like better for us as a species to have low attention spans now, which is really, really weird and really not a good thing, to be honest with you. That's really bad. Like, it's just kind of a problem. Okay, well, if you're facing cold, uh, being problematic as per usual. <laughs> facing cold will fire like a unique projectile for a lane, and that projectile is big and concerning. It, it buffs zombies up by a lot when it hits them. Which isn't a great thing, and this is not a great deck either, for the record. Keep your shorts, man. Yeah, those are also an issue. But it's like, even we're just like kind of hard coded to be like that now. It's just like, that's what meter has become. Like, the average point in time someone will watch something or decide is like, eight seconds at most. It's absurd. And it's like it just because of how much meter is consumed now. Like, there's so much like TV shows, movies, and other things out there that. 
we kind of just have to make decisions quickly. It's why first impressions are so problem. Which is a problem. Like genuinely, it's a very scary thing. It's something that I've kind of grown to realize and... Good lord. Anyways, there's Piercing Cole doing its thing again. It's a pretty concerning upgrade to zombies because it's actually pretty significant. Like, very significant. You have to be very wary about it. Wrong plant. This doesn't even be great here. I just didn't think to bring it. Oh well. Whatever. It'll be fine. Do they have a choice in the matter? It just kind of has to be. We might just spend the sit down and watch those play game for hours and then, yeah. It's because of the lot going on. Like, for that, like, a trend of TikTok, TikTok with, his, TikTok with his, like, that dual screen thing where, like, there's something serious, that series going on one end, while there's just, like, something in the background going on. That style of content is even not even new. That's been around for, like, since, like, Leafy, was it? I think it's Leafy. It's, like, really old and really, really classic and very much a very proven way of doing it. It grabs your attention in both ways. You're coming to watch in the background and something, something interesting going on in front of it. Because we've just kind of just created such a bizarre society where that's just what we expect. It's kind of horrifying. Leafy is triggering memories. I wasn't really around on YouTube when Leafy was a thing. I'm just aware of them. Like, a lot of their style of content was very much kind of like tier 2 pop corn or something in the background. And I, I, when I was younger, I didn't actually watch like YouTubers I shouldn't be watching. So ha, I am a good boy. I am a good boy. I've always have been a good boy. <laughs> oh dear. But I'm aware of the fact that what I kind of did, and they're not a great person at all. I'm not going to claim they are. But there's a certain amount of stuff laying to them. And like the style of content works works for a reason, and it's very clear that it just can become a lot of things. I don't know. At this point, my commentaries are falling down because they seem you'll know what I mean here. It's just like, right now, that is a lot of us our content because it kind of has always been a thing. It's just like now people have really started to click why it works. Was it just completed? Uh, Defrost, 45 plants. It's just kind of. Yeah. Same thing, don't you take another thing about my device. I don't know. I don't, know. I'm not, I don't do TikTok. I've never done TikTok. I think it's just too much. It's just not something I'm a fan of. I've never actually been interested in like TikTok for a reason. Neither YouTube shorts, but I probably have to do some at some point. I'll probably do videos somewhere some like minor things like we should be balancing jalapeno around cherry bomb instead of like squashing a cherry bomb maybe could work for that. I'm just not a big fan of like shorter videos. I've never have been. Big YouTubers are a fan of horror content. You guys have been giving me notes. Yeah. It's bad. Right now. Nobody actually likes the new changes. Well, here you go. Here's Fire P. They don't affect me, but do suck. Yeah, they don't affect me either, but they are not good. Like at all. Pipe it up, PNG. No. No. For shifty, yeah, this is a this is a Gatling P. Do we need the Colonel Copaster in here again? Um This looks concerning. That is a lot of plants to lose. A lot of plants. Probably too much. Why am I saying like this? I have no clue. Well I guess that means we're going ahead with this. Addressing for the game, I'll bring a cherry bomb just in case. And guava just in case. There was guava. I'm missing it. There we go. Yeah, I know. Losing plan, I know. I know, game. 
I'm about to close up the fight by Anthem. I think a lot of people like myself aren't actually affected by them. They're just not, not good. Like, obviously not good. So nobody really likes them. That's kind of my fault, at least. Like, I am nothing the slightest by swearing, because I don't swear. Like, the cause I do the swearing is, like, fake swearing. Or, like, that's how people tend to call it, like... Heck or crap, which aren't really swear words. They're just semi-close to them being the thing. What is down here? Honestly, I kind of think I shouldn't be putting down... Uh... More... Like, more that many more stun flowers, because we've got a lot of them here to go through. Hmm. Okay. Uh, please don't eat the sun. You're eating sunflower. Cut that. I can't stop that, no matter what. Uh, I'll just charge you for now. That seems even smart play, at least. More snowstorms, scary and quick. But whatever. The time I saw when you started blowing up, um, the, the Eclipse Mint video, yeah. That was the first time, I, that's like the only time I ever swear on, on camera or anything. I don't swear much in my own time either, I just don't know that kind of person. It's just not how I roll. I don't like swearing. I don't think it's really necessary. That's just the kind of person I am, though. Like, I'm, I'm not... Okay. I, swearing is not necessary, yeah, because it's like kind of, it's just a word, it's just language. It's not inherently evil or anything. I know some people tend to believe it is, it's not. It's just language, it's words. But I just don't swear much, I don't enjoy it. I don't think it's necessary. Yeah, but not, yeah, right now the tag monopoly is a big problem. Yeah, I know yeah, I know exactly what you mean. I agree entirely. Uh we just don't have anything to really do with those laws. Though, me. Was it him wearing tiny mouth creature? It's a Sasquatch. Sasquatch him. That's his job. He's just a cosplayer, I guess. I don't know. Oh, yeah, no, it's his fire P for record. Uh, knows how he's firing really, really fast. That is his gimmick. It fires quickly. It is very scary. It is very strong, too, so it's pretty good. Ah, uh, just don't trade on. Now. Ah, uh, I did not mean to put you down. Ah, uh, crap. Well, whatever. Hey. I don't like that. All this. All this in general. Hmm. I need more of these fly piece desperately. Why the big? Uh, that's piercing colder. That's his gimmick. It buffs zombies a ton, gives them a ton more HP, and makes everything harder. That's what it does. Ah, crap! 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 Uh, crap! 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 crap. I didn't see you there until it was too late. I could not see how many zombies in C select. I did not see Sasquatch swim on his C select. I just didn't see what was there. How long does it take me to make a video? It depends on the video, but it can take a very long time. Uh, I usually take a few days off now, so it's not. So it's just kind of important to keep that in mind. But it usually takes me like uh, five days, five to seven days. Usually three to four days in, uh, four to five days for, uh, strip drying usually. Then, like, generally two to three days wedded together. The strip drying is the hardest part because I sometimes just need to get a good script going and that's very, very difficult, really. Well, here's where things started to get a bit more interesting. 
Greg over here. Just immediately. Okay, thank you, game. Awesome. I love this. Ah, whatever. Just make sh I just heard a noise of a crystal skull triggering. Oh god, those things are horrifying. I just can vaguely hear the noises of them triggering, and it's just kind of dead or dead or alive. Go, where are they? But I just can't see them because I'm just too busy focusing on anything else. I remember Sloth and Gang Group, yeah, they just died. It is truly the greatest travesty we will ever see in our lives. I'm just cherry bombing you before you become a problem. And you. And I guess you're getting plant fooded. Just for equal fair measure, I guess. We still have like 10 plants to lose before last wave, we're probably fine. <laughs> I think writing scripts can be very tedious at times. It takes a lot of effort and takes a lot of time. But honestly, at a certain point, you just kind of get used to it. I don't mind writing scripts at this point. Sometimes, sometimes I really enjoy writing some scripts. I just kind of write because I feel like I have to. All those last scripts I have times that I like, but I try to get down scripts I just don't enjoy writing now. Like, I really enjoy writing scripts around, like... And, like, specific, like, specific plans and things are very easy to write scripts for for me. Like, I have a lot I can say about all things. Yeah. Here's I'm just winning live enough super chats. Uh, right now I'm going I'm still just playing head like Patreon stuff, so when it happens, it'll also happen. So yeah. It'll happen eventually, just not yet. Green feels like a potential roadblock. It's difficult at times, but it's not horrible. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. It just takes a long time to work on. It's why I spend a lot of time working on scripts. I do know long scripts on pizza too. I find scripts hard to write in general sometimes. Penny should, we be, Penny, should we really be worried about these zombies? They're so small. Small not. These are can still break your kneecaps. Ouch. Oh no. Do you not like writing scripts on PC2? Yeah. PC2 script writing is annoying because it's just not very good. Oh, I get to pick my plans. Huh, okay. Well... That's neat. I didn't think to see this one. Since he didn't see this one coming. Uh, EP, I guess, makes sense. EP and I don't know. I don't actually know. Ah, uh, I, I guess purple because I need something for heating. Yeah, purples. Okay. Take on some focus, cause yeah. Yeah. This whole gimmick is gonna be counterplay between uh, piercing colds and shrinking zombies, I presume, and that's gonna be the main gimmick. <laughs> God damn it. That's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. Off you go. Ah, no, this is like vanilla. Okay, okay, this is that. This is okay. That's really stupid. Then okay, that's fine. <laughs> I don't know if it levels ice wind or not, but I'm gonna play around assuming it does have ice wind because I'm just not sure. They quick, indeed they are. I can kill these guys with Chargard, I think. Yeah. Okay, Chargard early game, let's go. Best early game plants. Nothing can top it. 
Um, back you go. Okay. Uh, stun you in this. Back you go again, because you're a concern. I'm playing this like an absolute genius. This is exactly meant to play this level. Uh. Well, crap. I'll restart and bring some early game, okay? That makes sense. Because I have, like, no early game here, and that's just not a good plan. I'll get a char guard for. Probably Endurian, I guess. It's not a wall plan, but Endurian is way more reliable. No, oh, whatever. Needy pea shooter. Truly, truly. Wrestling is good. Wrestling is good. Yeah. Wrestling is good. I just. I've used wrestling already a lot, so I kind of want to make sure I don't use it again. Then again, I am also. The alternative I'm using is Endurian, which I use all the time, so, meh. I am bad for this, to be honest. I'm very biased towards certain plans, I think, when I play mods. I I'm trying to get out of it. I I'm definitely better than some people I know. I'm not the worst for this, but I am not good for this. I like everything that's that. Every thing has got some good thing. I fully recommend Armory Vessel. It's just a real mod to play. Okay. I'll take your word for it. If I have time at some point when I'm finished like Persona 3 again, I'll see what I can do. I've been busy playing out recently. Just kind of been what I've been into. It's a good game. But yeah, I, I, I've really been meaning to play more mods for a long time now. Just haven't got around to it. To address you. Yeah, Endurian is absolutely good in levels like this. Anyways, uh, time for EP to do shenanigans. I thought the first one top lane, so it's not doing much, but whatever. Oh, okay, thank you, Pharaoh. <laughs> Your hitbox knows no bounds. Literally, in this case. Eat box, whatever, whatever. That was only free. Hey, it's pretty good. I'd recommend trying to get the PS2 version if you can. But because that's because the PS2 version is better than the portable version, which is the current release. But it's good. Now there's like nothing to do with the video, so I probably stop talking about these kind of things. Planet of the Endurance. Why? We don't need to plan to the Endurance. It's not a good plan. It just seems like an absolute waste, to be honest. So far, we're in good. It's fine. It's just kind of uh, the best. I think the best way to describe it is that Persona 3 Portable isn't 3D. Well, well, the PS2 version is, so you can do a lot of that way. Like cutscenes are also entirely gone. So yeah, just a kind of recommendation. Anyways, here's a, here's a mini gog. He's tiny. He's small, but he's ready to break our kneecaps. So be very careful of him. Just like in real life. Just like in real life. If you see small guys with big clubs, don't, don't get near them. That is generally going to murder you really, really badly, so just don't. It's not worth it. And life advice of creeps. <laughs> oh dear. At the very least, they don't throw rims because it's fish wrong. That's genuinely really helpful. <laughs> Okay, uh, just put you here. Do you also get mutant bell peppers? I roll, yeah, exactly. 
a generally a good call against these things, especially if you electric peas as well. They're they're really good as well, but you just have to go and leave the tail from sadly. Nobody really doing them proper. Nobody really like properly sells them these days. Apparently because they're just like really dangerous, so, like nobody really likes them. Pirating games without paying or illegally. Uh, pirating games is when you get games Stanley Game Free Online, basically. Uh, don't do it. Um, I'm legally obligated to say, don't pirate things. You're kind of just wasting people's time and effort when you do that, and it's not very good of you, but... Sometimes you just, just sometimes you kind of have to, because some games are really old and just don't exist anymore. Otherwise, like, game preservation versus piracy is a big issue. Gonna pirate PC even though it's free. I mean, you don't. Unfortunately, that's like an issue with mods though. Like, a lot of mods require you to do like piracy. Couldn't to some extent, which is annoying because it just kind of has to work. It's like a lot of when you learn to mod games, it results in piracy. But that's just kind of fact. It's an, it's an issue. Anyways, here's endless. No idea, actually, it's a thing. Exactly. You just need, just have to look over. It's like very under the table stuff. This is literally just a block of ice. You say, have you ever wondered how these items are keys to dimensions of infinite zombies? Dunno. Ice blocks are cool though. Oh my god, I made a pun! That's so cool! My god, it again! <laughs> Penny is upset. Penny is very upset. Get that thing, X launch is more defensive than Y launch, just to realize you're playing a tower defense in which no strategy is defensive. I mean, technically, it can work. Game for G2A? What's G2A? What's that? Hmm. I've never heard of that. I don't, I don't recognize the synonym. Oh, Team Key website, right. Okay, fair enough. Got it. I just, I'm just not, I'm just have a loop of this kind of thing. This is not my kind of stuff. Play offensive your zombies. Okay, this is a defensive level, then, eh? Ah, uh, you could. I'm going to need these plants, and there's a corn here, so I'm going to need them. Uh, we do get some sunflowers, though, so that's something. I guess our game plan here is. A uh, shovel? Mmm. I think it is just kernel. No, is it? Mmm. I don't know, I don't like this. I can't really think of a good way to do this comfortably. I think hot potatoes are gonna be it then. Uh, st stall, yeah, chard guard. And puff stream, just for stalling. And. I guess I'll bring some DPS. I'll bring, uh. Blast Revine, just in case. Cool. I think that should be good here. No, it's not. There is no world in which that plan is good, so it's not good. Simple as. Okay, now I have to wait a bit. Because we are going to need to wait a bit. Okay. I'll get these corner cannons out now because they're corner cannons. And I'll get rid of these so I can start bringing two dice blocks for free. Okay. You can just use a bit of an AA, yeah. Yeah, I think that's kind of been a thing for a while. I'm not necessarily sure that's really true though. I can see like the argument both ways. It's just games. Games aren't really easy to judge. Properly at least. I do think Indian games are more enjoyable for me personally, but it's all about the personal preference, really. Okay, uh, level's going along quite well right now. Uh, this one, it'd be so on if it breaks, so I'll just get rid of them, get them open now. Probably replace some of these with uh, twin sunflowers, honestly. Think about it, that's probably a smart move in some regard. 
Because we're going to be using these things a lot, so we could we need them to be solid. At least. Okay. Uh, but you want some of these things just to start getting some more action up here near. Uh, one of the big issues with Brawlcunter in these kind of levels is that Brawlcunter makes things worse often. Did the stream lag in? It seems like it's not on my phone, so I'm just kind of making keeping an eye on it. Should be fine. Yeah, it seems fine. Okay. My phone just being stupid then. Okay. What do you think about Crosscode? Honestly, I want to play Crosscode again at some point. I really do enjoy my time with it. I beat the game and the DLC. I think the story is a bit off at times, but I really do like the DLC. The DLC is really good. Is there any... No lag, okay. Well, that's nice to hear, I guess. Eee, that's... Yeah, okay, you're gone now. That's unfortunate. I would like to have you around, but it looks like that's not going to be a thing. Those are the NFT games some big streamers making. I have no clue, and I don't care. There are some really crappy people out there, but we already know that. That's not new knowledge, right? That's my mindset, at least. People will always be crappy and stupid. You just have to sleep past it and just make sure that you follow people you actually do believe are capable of doing good or decent things. Which are always going to seem more rare than they actually are, just by the nature of one day. There's a lot of bad people in the world, basically. Good DLC puzzles torturing. I didn't mind the puzzles. I enjoy the puzzles. I enjoy a, enjoy a good puzzle. But yeah. Crystal's really good, by the way. If you're interested in doing like an action RPG kind of thing, Crystal's really good. The story has some issues, but it's generally a pretty good story. A lot of people really like the story, so. Could be me and my weird standards of many things. What do you mean when you say Hunter's levels made this worth, by the way? Uh, Hunter's zombies make this worse because they speed up ways a lot. Uh, because of the way HP works in this game, and Valk Hunters are very tanky and get flung immediately to your lawn, so you have to deal with them immediately, they cause waves to go by a lot faster when they show up in numbers. So it's just something to be very wary of, like constantly. I don't know if this image will ever be useful to you, but it's a very use very good to know and keep in mind sometimes. Sometimes being the keyword. Is the Ransom across quest? Is the Ransom when has a character be good? I don't really think so. I mean, I guess you're really pushing it, but honestly, you could probably just bring like fire P and you'd be fine here. And to be entire, we don't even need it here. Like here, while I'm not necessarily doing fantastically, I'm not doing badly. We have resources to beat the level. It's not a challenge to beat it. Yeah. Give me one situation where it can be useful. Since I've character can create infinite damage on Holy Barrier and break the entire game in half for free. Yeah, there's nothing really useful here. Anyway, here's the sweet potato, the last plan in the world. Uh, don't ask why it's here, I don't remember. I genuinely do not remember why Hot Potato is in this world. Oh, wait, no, it was like. Oh, yeah, no, 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 no. It's Hot Potato or Soybean, that was a decision. Right, yeah. Uh, the decision for a while what plan was going to be in the world, and I think it's been like Sweet Potato and uh, Soybean for the longest time. The plan was always going to be a uh, Cedium plant, so yeah, I just remember that. Okay, Peace Paint is called the Boost Hunter Zombies. Tip, effects can be reapplied to your objective after previous effects wore off. Pissing Cold always comes on, wave on lane 3. Okay, cool. 
Thank you, game. Very cool. Ah, crap, it's an objective. <laughs> hi, Leah. Hi, hi. Yeah, it's good, bit. Also, Celery Stalker's here, and Celery Stalker wasn't even the, wasn't even the game yet. So this was the first time ever anybody saw Celery Stalker in this mod. Wow. Oh, gee, I wonder what the game wants me to do here. Hmm. Ah, whatever. I could probably just... Spow Hurricane on you, and that does the job just fine. Holy Barry is a good plan. Yeah. We didn't use Holy Barry very much though, sadly. I wish we could use it more than we actually have. Just hasn't really been a good place to use it, I guess. Up, oh, here we go. Round one, baby. And thankfully, we also have this, so... Free knockback. Yeah, that's not good. Mm, okay, that's not great. Meh. I can do that though, that's just like drag some more into middle lane. And just keep pushing them back. I should probably get this going again. Okay. Uh, that sucks. I got rid of zombies in the middle lane. Or did I? Or did I? Ah, uh, that works. Yeah, that works. <laughs> cool. Okay. Weedle orders sucks here, but... Well, whatever. What can, what, no, can I even do about that? I mean, I guess we potato is a good defense. That's something, I guess. Okay, just go. I can, you can, you can deal with them, right, Pichita? You're not weak. You can do that. I believe in you. Just push you back again. What are these extras? Torch was meant for. I genuinely don't know. I guess it's like. Ensure that these don't do anything stupid, and that's generally a fine plan. Kill. Amazing cold progress is being made. Was it because there's a lot of stalls in this field? Oh, that's bad. Well, whatever. We'll have to live, I guess. Bathroom Potato is in all position right now. Just hold off a bit longer. Up another Celery Stalker here, just so I get extra DPS. Celery Stalker is a godsend. At move. Hush. I can probably get that Cone Ed too in here. Nah, I got a bucket at least. Okay, cool. We're almost done with the objective. Nice. <laughs> Two potato sweep, yeah. Middle lane is packed, yep, yeah, because that's the only lane we can beat the objective in, so it's very important we actually cover that lane. Like, a lot. That was a large chompy noise. I wonder what caused that. Hmm. Uh. Just push. I go to this as well. Uh, I need to just put more salary stalkers down. We have so many salary stalkers, I'm just not using them enough. Uh, I should be fine. Right. I should probably put down a uh, salary stalker too to cover up clear of this lane. 
Ah, uh, okay. Piercing coal is now done. Now to try to chip away at these idiots for a while. I guess torch was AOA, so we can use a torchwood to explode constantly. And that's our best DPS against these guys. Brilliant. Wonderful. This is exactly how Torch was intended to be used in, in this game for the record. This is 100% exactly what they wanted Torch to do. Okay, there we go. And now there's a million half weasel everywhere, so we hope the plants can handle them. Oh, not. There's only one, really. Huh. Well, whatever. At the very least, Torch also gives AoE to peace, so we can do that. Pretty insane, honestly. Yeah, I agree. Hurry is very, very good. Hey, love the game with this ghost pepper. Okay, that's good. That's really helpful. Thank you, game. That's genuinely really appreciate it. That's more so quality of life than anything, but it's nice to have, for sure. And there you go. That's the entire lane cleared up. So now we just finish up everything else, which is just this. Improvise jalapeno. <laughs> sure, it works. It's a good plan, though, to be fair. Unlike jalapeno, which is garbage. There you go. Level done. Goodbye, Renoa. It is out of nowhere, but it's good. <laughs> that basic zombie was really far back. Jesus Christ. Is that it? Okay, cool. Almost done. Almost done. Only, like, three more levels. Woo. Late to party indeed, everything else is already dead. Okay, next level. What's our next objective to deal with? With pain and suffering. Looming in our hearts. <laughs> these zombies are good, let me tell ya. They make these zombies every once in a while. Good for both offense and defense. But they're not defensive, Dave. <laughs> zombies can also use sliders. Kinda makes me jail, so. And lastly, they're very yummy. I don't think you should be eating those, he's a Dave. Don't care. Tastes good. Please don't eat the Zoi, he's a Dave. This is not a good plan. Good, he's a Dave. Wrong spelling of offensive defense. Okay, that's funny. I'd be surprised, but I'm not. Uh, <laughs> Hello, Night Puff. What are you doing here? It's a daytime. Uh, what? Why are you here? <laughs> Why? Why are you nighttime version? There's like no reason for that to be the case. Ah, uh, okay, sure, whatever. It's fine. It's very normal. Makes the other game easy at least. It's fine. <laughs> Light inversion? Yeah. Uh, mushrooms in Alphas get stronger at night, so... It's just kind of weird that this is a thing. Sun throws. Nighttime, actually. True. That actually works. Clearly. I see we finally encoded a great mystery. Oh, whatever next level is, so next level gonna be cool. You guys gonna like the next level, I think. Just kind of thing you had. The next level is one of the neat ones. Honestly, Alpha has a lot of really good levels from time to time. It's something I really like about this. I think its level design is genuinely great. It's like most level, most worlds always have at least one level just incredibly unique and memorable. And levels that are intended at least be fun, like in some way. I'm just gonna stall that for now, I can't be able to deal with it. <laughs> ah, that's such a juicy sunny I can't give it up. That's so good. Oh, and he, oh, and I stole it. I thought I could slice work, neat. I mean, he's like a huge dead spot here that zombies just don't, these guys don't work in. Huh. Oh, well. I should probably unfreeze these. 
This is unfortunate. I can't actually spam them because hot potato cancel is a plant. That's funny. Unfortunate, but funny. Okay, get rid of some of these plants. We don't need them. Uh, you can just be a stunion, I think. Does all you slide on all PUZ? They should do. Just nobody cares. So all you just stuff like facing gold. Did they? That's nice. That's funny. That's good. I'm glad the game is really just letting these guys really show off. You can be the stunning. <laughs> Probably even a plan at this point. Honestly, it's technically a plant, but that's really the closest it gets. It's not really a plant. Natural advantage, they get buffed by Pizzing Cold. True, true. Okay, I should probably just get my hands back on the keyboard and just start spamming my uh, shenanigans, because keybinds are great. There you go, freeze. Is good. Unfortunately, that's the one zombie's gonna screw it over, but we get some good damage up at least. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Uh, crap. That's not a good thing. I don't think they... Zoy... Zoy beans don't... Okay, it's fine. I guess the Charles already, already exists for it. Okay. I can stand there for a second. Like, Oh, hello, the animator. Okay, that should be fine. Just a basic right now. Mm, I don't like you though. You, you are a concern, I think. And a very real one. Stunning in before you... Okay, cool. Okay, I have some tree damage on you, I guess, and just knock you back again. Okay, that's piercing cold. It's activated again. Uh, shovel you. Just make sure I'm never wasting slots and I should be fine. In theory, at least. Okay, well that's... Well, that's why I've been killed these of the animator. It is something. Legally. Uh, Sonia, please. That didn't do enough. Okay, crap. And down here, things are going, going great. And they start swarming. Okay, I need to plan through to deal with that lane. Well, technically it's like a bunch of lanes coalescing into a single problem, but whatever. It's like being take the hits from you. Oh, cry. Ah, maybe we're fine. After you saw a kill, though, to make sure you're gonna make catch up. Eh. Ah, crap. God, deal with a single weasel. God damn it. Oh, and I can't destroy that. That's cool. I. And I killed the guy. Yeah, I saw that one coming. Zoyan plant food isn't that good. Zoyan plant food is not that good. It feels good, but it is not actually that good. Well, we're guaranteed a victory at least, that's something. <laughs> that's a positive. Okay, well that's sunny in there, that's juicy. And another stun you, another, like, charge off too. How much of a Zoygarg? I don't actually know. I think it's... I actually have no clue. I'm pretty sure it's, like, just normal Garg health, but I could be totally wrong on that. 
I'm not particularly the biggest fan of Zoybeans, so I don't really know the numbers. I should probably knock you back more. Uh, this is another... Another Sunion, Sunion, Sunion. I am selected. Whatever. Need the freezing. Yeah, I know this is was like that, I just didn't have a chance to really pay attention to it. Doesn't matter a huge deal, frankly, it is just kind of thing. Okay, and I will love one more sun, please, game. <laughs> well, that's crap. <laughs> I needed more than that. And you, well, I'm not losing more. You're not just, screw it, we'll just lose Moe's. Losing Moe's is like so much easier than actually trying to handle this horde. Like, we can clearly beat this level, but there's no point. We're running out of time here. It's like, 340. Let's just go. Let them die. Okay. We have five plant food slots now. We will never need damage plant food slots, but we have five now. Okay. <laughs> useless. It's not useless. I, it means I can save some. Oh my pod, what happened here? Dr. Thomas' experiments seem to get more and more out of the ordinary. You took our plans and experiment them? That's unacceptable! But you did just do that in the previous era, Dave. Come on, Penny, there's nothing to compare here. What's done can't be undone. Anyways, these charges are quite interesting, I'd say. They regrow infinite leaves, and the inverted ones knock zombies backwards. At least it's all for a good challenge. Aw, those poor chart guards. So, level gimmick is a weird one. <laughs> these chart guards will throw zombies into an infinite loop. That is the level gimmick. So, yeah, no escape, but it is a level name. The zombies, the, the zombies will be stuck in a very large loop of death, so it is something to very much keep an eye on, I think. We <laughs> vertical less than like it, but it's in the PvP mod. The official name are Evil Child Guards for record, but that's their actual name, so... That's funny. I'm sure people find some comedy in that fact. I'll bring uh, electric. I'll bring blah 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 too. Okay. Evil char god debut. Yep. It's also a good char god. Char aren't actually in danger. Just meant to catch them. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that this level will spam a ton of zombies, but they just never can do anything. Like, I believe the loss condition here is very much just kind of... Uh... Weird. Anyways, I went to the level gimmick. <laughs> These Chargos have, like, functionally infinite HP as well, for the record, so... Yeah. They'll, he'll be stuck in his hell forever. He cannot escape. There is no way for him to get out of this. He is just eternally stuck like this. It's a weird level. You can still lose, though, because some zombies here are actually dangerous. And mostly the fact that there is a uh, very real possibility you just kind of can't do anything anymore. And mostly wizards. Wizards are in this level, remember, and wizards can disrupt your defense enough, and they can disable these char guards. If they disable them enough, you just get screwed. Really badly. So just keep that in mind when you when you play when you're playing this level. But we should be fine here, in theory.
Just trying to make sure we get rid of these zombies before they cause an issue. And we should be a okay. I'm just gonna bag, let's chip away at them, because we're a bag that can just do a lot of damage and they cover the Epia middle lane, which is also there. And Dodos are also Dodos, so yeah, we need to make sure we keep an eye on those, because I just forgot they were in the level again, like an absolute moron. I can play this Black Rogue there, just an extra tip. Just gonna plan with you so I can get some more Rotos there down, because I could do more Rotos right now. Okay, I need to make sure you kill these wizards instantly, because they will just the charts, and if they do, we kind of just die in the spot for free. Which isn't a good thing. Where does... Where'd my Rotos go? What, what killed them? Oh, crap. That's fine, that's like the least in half of one. I'm not that bored about those dying, but they do cause to lose some plans, I guess, technically. No, the yelling, this won't get annoying extremely fast or anything, no. It's very normal, very good volume. I'm sure nobody will complain about this. Okay, hello, wizards. I'm just gonna put another bag up here. I should probably put some things around here just to protect them from the hunters, I think. Might make sense. I guess I'll put you here. There's a reason not to. So I have like at least some heating going on to make sure they don't get frozen forever so I can use that space for more and stuff. We may as well make sure we get them the full useful pl plants we've got here. So I guess keeping him frozen also just means you have more space to kill zombies in. Then maybe this approach is double. Okay, well. Ah! Where's the wheel spawning? There we are. <laughs> hey! That's not bad. That's not good. That's not good. I think I may need to put down like a spike rock back here. I think might be a play then. Maybe. That's a weird thing to say, but I think it might just be the play. Okay, I'll start doing it then, just in case. That's an emergency option. It means that the weasel can never be a problem, which is a big deal. Just kind of the safety. I they just throw him straight into the loop. Dogs are not very nice to the rims. Just in general, really. I can put a row bag here just to make extra DPS in all lanes. Oh, that's a... Okay, row bag cover it. Cool. Oh, that's a... Not comfortable placement. Okay, uh, get my son. We should be fine. Evil Chargard, yeah. Okay, uh, Weasel got killed by the Chargard, by the Spike Rock there, so that was definitely the right play. I just make sure these Wizards can't do anything stupid. Okay. Wizards are the biggest thing if they can break the loop, and they're the, probably the most dangerous thing we have right now on the screen. <laughs> as a result. Being able to break the loop is really bad because we kind of need to do that because 
Otherwise, evil Charguide will just murder us in our sleep. We're not really prepared to deal with it with being broken. Okay, there's a Gargantua, so we can go deal with you. Okay. I believe that should be it. This level's weird. Yeah, this is level's kind of bizarre, but you know, it's fine. It's a fun level. You'll never get past my evil death trap here, with Child Guard. It says evil ch Child Guard in an evil tone. Rah! It says Child Guard, heroically. Well, we did it. We beat the, beat the level now. I love this level. It's just a fun level. It's a fun concept. It's a very silly one, but it's good. <laughs> what the hell are wizards doing here? Wizards are dangerous in that level because they can disable the, the charge from a distance. And if they do, the loop gets broken, and the loop being broken usually kills you. So yeah. So a tale of two, two charts. I get so much money. This is a mod, it's not vanilla, so we don't actually have that much money. Extreme time. Let's get this level done. I'm a natural storyteller. Okay, this is going to be an interesting level. I could try... Electricity shenanigans. Electricity, electric current shenanigans. It's not very reliable though, so I want to make sure I bring some other things just in case. I think this is a decent layout. Can we get the special shards right now? And no, the shards are not allowed, not, allowed, not in the game probably, that way. Can email Poppy A to add Evil Child Guard. Yeah, it's such a good plant. They'll totally accept without question. <laughs> There's Child of PNG. I wonder if Evil Child is in the. Uh... Ow. I, I, I wonder if it's actually in, like, the uh, kid or anything. Because that'd be really funny to me if it was. I doubt it, but it'd be funny. Because it's, like, the most pointless plant up there. I don't want to knock back my defense, yeah. Such a good plan, but oh well. Okay. Uh, I have to just shovel up these plants later, these sunflowers later, I think. Because this is going to be a difficult level. It's, it's the third round. Okay. This is going to be a bit scary. Uh, do I have to set up, like, these things already? Maybe. I don't know. Uh, I don't think I have this done to. Hmm. Okay, you have to go down. I hate the fact that I have to put you down, but I'm gonna have to put you down now. That's way too early, but I don't have a choice. The game's not giving me any sun, so that's not helping either, frankly. Well, early game OS track, let's go. <laughs> okay, that's at least some damage up, but I need some need need like a inferno ASAP. We need sun, we need things, we need many things. Uh I think Heater right now is enough Bank to get by, I think? Yeah. Power, uh, Pat Plan Food, uh, is god tier and he's on extra current. It's just really good. Okay. Okay, at least we got some damage up now. Not a great amount of it, but some damage. I could, I could take a risk. I think that's an. I think I could definitely push you here. Uh, then, mm -hmm. okay. C 
crap. Risk was not worth it. That did not pay off. Oh well. Unfortunate, but that's life. I guess. Okay, uh... I think the middle lanes for the time being don't need any sun, don't need any peep, don't need peepods, so I'm just not gonna worry about those. Instead, I'm just going to do this. And I do need to kill that top lane, actually. That top lane's not going. Okay, cool. Ah, crap! Anyways, if he's fifth cold, are now doing a really awkward angle, so that's a issue. Really, an issue. Ah, uh, that's... okay. Please, please, okay, cool. If I'm lucky. Okay. I can do that, and that should hopefully help. Okay. Be pod if you have to go here now. Bring them again next time. I think we're fine. I don't think we're gonna lose this yet. I think you need a bit more faith in that chat. A little bit more faith. Because here's the thing, you don't seem to recognize yet. With it up. I'm at a position now where I am basically already winning. If he's always moving to similar lanes, I just need to make sure that I can maintain this and I don't see that being a huge problem. It just kind of has to be a case where I just need to make sure I can expand late game. Where's piercing gold? Where's it coming in? Where didn't do anything, okay. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna put down some more. Okay, I will probably, uh, I should be fine. Uh, Sweet Potato and Char Guard are a really good combo. Okay, that does actually do that. Okay, cool, that's fine. Uh, I guess I'll deal with that. I have a plan to be able to do that, I think. Actually, Garg I can't deal with, can I? Hmm. I guess we have to kill the Gargantua. Right? Yeah. Okay, Gargantua 1 down, that's an issue, but I'm alive. My defrosting is entirely gone, my sweet potatoes are gone, but it's fine. I'm still winning, I'm still not losing, I'm, I'm not losing just yet. I need to make sure I have something to deal with Gargs then. Okay, that's fine. I can do that. I just need to make sure I put them on peepods, I guess. Don't know a lot of space being my biggest issue by a lot, but that's what I can do. Okay, I'll try to get these to get max of these people, then I'll get more. I think that makes sense. Pfft, that middle column is going stupid. <laughs> Okay, piercing cold happened. It didn't even do very much, so that is a good thing. We're just coming in from every angle now. <laughs> this happens how it works. They come in everywhere. <laughs> it's a fun gimmick, honestly. It's just kind of a very strange gimmick, but a very fun one for that reason. Okay, that's bad. And these frost winds as these ice flames colds are still going on. They are not ending. They do not seem to want to end ever, which is unfortunate because that's kind of what we want. But I think we're fine. Just hold on a bit longer. Should be all we need. At bottom lane, I see the Gargantua. I am going to 
get screwed by it, I can not do much about that yet. Because the fear and cold are still going on. Okay, middle lane. Have to start moving you around. Uh, Ah, no, that Inferno died. Inferno cannot die here. I think the game plan now is just move it to middle, move it to middle lane. I think. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Almost. Eh. Uh, okay, that's a loss. I can I can redeem that. I tried. Okay, maybe we should probably bring not a gimmicky star around the last current this time. Uh, 3P is not going to work well here, so just get 5P spam. Like, for free, like, uh, purple spam. 3P just does not do anything here. Love Glove is not good either. Inferno's just can't deal with Gark, so there's no point bringing it. I think this is more deck I need. I think. Uh, anything else for early game, I think, as well. I'll bring Puff Stream. Avoid. Uh, because this. The way, the way I'm thinking about this now, and this is why I'm thinking these plants, I need to make sure that I have DPS against Gargantuas, but I also need to make sure that my plants aren't being frozen constantly. So I need, uh, so I need, like, need like a lot of defense that isn't being frozen. I don't think f Ice P. I, I don't think uh, 5P is good enough. I think Purple might be. But I also need people just to make sure I have enough DPS late game. Because that is a very real concern, too. And Pushroom also just helps stall our gargs, which is always good. Pushroom is pretty good, actually. I'll put you here, just so I have more space for later on. Okay, uh... Put you here. Cool! Okay, if I pulled up there, uh, bats and flat pins are fought out, which tell about it a bit early game, but just like push, which is probably fine. Probably for the best, honestly. Okay, piercing cold is here. It has begun. Shocker, but the second they use a more normal strat, the level comes way easier. Shocker, right now. Such a wild con concept to grasp. Oh dear. Okay, start building a P pod, so I think is the next step. Uh. Top lane next one, because there's a South Squash in there, there's Squash room, but never mind. Okay, I... yep, still up here. I'll just have to... Go around plant. I'm looking at my keybinds now. That's never a good sign. Uh... Here. Just put another fair hold here, because that hold's pretty good. Uh, okay, I still need to put something in the bomb lane so I don't die to the inevitable stuff there. That's not the that's a word. How many more levels? This is the last level of the stream. So, as soon as you beat this, we're done. And there's only one world left. Which will be exciting. No. 
Okay. And now that people should hopefully never get frozen, so we can keep our DPS forever. Uh... Okay... I don't think it matters. That's not enough of an issue. Yep. Okay. I think we're golden. I think we've just, we've uh, settled now. Just keep building up our pea pods. Keep an eye for and Schwarz and Stunny and then we We should be good to go. We don't have to depend on it. Honestly, no. We don't have enough time. If stream were, if stream was working, we would do it. But if stream was working bad, we'd do it. But. It's not working right this stream, so we just have to cut it off quickly. It sucks, because I'd love to give him a PR party today, but, ah, well. I'll live. I can keep putting down my sunflowers here, to be honest. Oh, so I may go took these down so I can put my, like other stuff in. Okay. I have to put down more for well, pee pebbles in this lane. We're seeing how many people are watching it on the friend chat. Yeah, it's fairly common. Like, I think like 9% of everybody doesn't interact online. Just 5% of everybody just like, 9% of everybody just watches, I think. It's fine, I don't mind. It's just kind of interesting to note. Okay, yes, yeah, second flag. Yeah, I think we're good to go. Pepples are good. So that's kind of helping just a bit. They're just helping to make sure that these peepaws don't go down. Which is good because these peepaws going down just kind of kills instantly. It's so a good spot. It's doing darn well here. I was saying it's doing well. Go splash damage onto it, got decent DPS. It's doing good. It's a pretty good sword to hold around attacker. Not because the splash is an awful but hey. That's a real shock to nobody, I imagine. Good splash makes a plant that has splash damage, not terrible. And freeze you. I'll stun you or whatever. Just gives it more room to work with. Okay. Just wait. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> it's under for a second, but it's all good. I can use Pushroom again to stall out the gogs. A gog in this case. Yeah, they're only introverted. I'm a real introverted. Some people are both, to be honest. I've been both, actually. It was like a period of my life where I couldn't play MMOs because it just felt so awkward with other people watching. Like, good ironically. That was one of the weirdest parts of my life, I think, though. I've kind of wanted to move trying to be fast at. But I still don't play MMOs because I just enjoy them. I guess like Beast One, but Beast One's weird. Just spam five up five full well, food just to clear the entire field, and that should be it for the day. Since they the challenge keeps all done, I gotta say. I don't think it really matters. I think 
I think as long as, I think it's just because of the lost stories, like people just being really dumb about it, and that's kind of caused people to not be a big fan of doing it. Some people are really dumb. Well, yeah, whatever. Level of the completed us. More or less, we just have to wait for the zombies down there to die. Because there's zombies summoning these things in. Oh, no, there's zombies up here. <laughs> very late still, very, very late. I, I love waiting for zombies to spawn, it's my favorite mechanic. And off it goes. It's still going. There we go. <laughs> and we're out of a cave. Phew. I still gonna get used to this cold, but now I gladly won't have to. And thank goodness you didn't freeze over or something too, Penny. That'd be very embarrassing of you, wouldn't it? It looks like a time machine, but it can't make it hit itself. Ah, that's true. Funny reference. Um, there we go! That will be the entirety of Frostbite Caves done. Uh, plants we get here? Sapling! Electric current! Sling pea! Pumpkin! Explore nut! Holly barrier! And squash! And hustle. We got one relevant seed tag ever at all of that for those last tens, so that's a good sign. So, I think it's about time we close off. I mean, it's what we always do, so. Real shock of air, I imagine. So, give me a second. Do we get another one? Oh, I, miss it. Oh, I think we've got ones here. Okay, cool. Okay. Uh, sorry. Just. Eh. Magic. I'll get close to this so I can so my mouse doesn't randomly disappear again, as it likes, likes to do. Oh. It. Okay, it's a bit for a second there again. I hate the mouse disappearing. It is an absolute. Pain. But yeah, tier list first before we leave off. We always do that. And uh, Salt Tomato, I'm willing to put this thing in D tier, I think. Salt Tomato is really good in endless zones, but normal play, it's really difficult to get it working. In that extreme level, it would have been good, but the extreme level is the exception. Oh, Sling Pea, that's the one I was missing. There it is. I was missing something. A Sling Pea, I'm gonna put Sling Pea in. B tier, I think. It's a good solid attacker. It's not put an A tier. I think it's on par for like Rapida and play Peapod. Really just strong all around attacker. Or <laughs> ranking evil Char Guard. Sadly, it doesn't exist. Why the Relic Plants are here and not Char Guard, I don't know, but whatever. Hot Potato, D, incredibly situational, and will never use it again in the life because there is nothing else to use it with. Stunyan, S tier. It's an absolutely broken staller plant that everybody kind of accepts is broken at this point because it's so strong. You generally always want to bring Sunyun unless you have a better plan to compensate. Uh, speaking of that, uh, this world has some really strong stallers. Like, absurdly strong stallers. Chard Guard is insanely good. It can cover most zombies well, with no real issue. Hurricane, just neutralize a lane for up for a very long damn time. So I see no reason to like put any love in S. These things are absurd. Uh, I'm gonna put Tweet Potato in D tier. I think it's not fantastic. I think it's very situational. You need good plans for it to work, and I don't think we really have a lot of great plants. Like electric like electric current is good, but too many plants kinda sweet potato plus currents. I could see this being put in D actually, and I'm actually gonna put D, I think. It's too situational. We don't really have a need to use it, so it doesn't make sense to put it much higher. F Y P Tutor is gonna be in C tier, solely because it kinda sucks in Frostbite Caves. It's a very expensive heater, 
which can't even kill like Sasquatch, Sasquatch imps. Like, why would you spend 400 sun on this? Like, it's not a bad plan, but people just entirely outclasses it. And you really should be running like Pebble or something, or something in those levels, anyways. Uh, speaking of which, Pebble goes in B tier. Peppled is just good. Solid around attacker. It's about as good as your attack in B tier. It's solid, it's reliable. Good damage, good splash. It's kind of like a mini uh, dandelion, really. Actually, yeah, it is just a mini dandelion, huh? Either way, it's good. And I think I don't need to cover why it's that good, I think. Rotobagger. Realistically, Rotobag is an A tier plant. But I can't use Rotobagger to in C tier. Like, okay, here's an explanation with Rotobagger. I personally can't get Rotobagger to work. I've never liked Rotobagger, and I do not think Rotobagger is a plant for me. Again, realistically, this plant should be here. It's very clearly good and very clearly strong. But I can't come but I can't use the darn thing. I am awful at using Starfruit. Starfruit Rotobagger. So I'm just gonna leave it down here for now. And that's it for today. We are close to finishing off this mod. There's only one world left and a few more plants left. Like, these are the only world plants left to rank. There's nothing else. We're almost done. I mean, we also have these two to rank next time and hopefully another premium plant, premium plant, because in a while we had one, but... Yeah, we are getting close to being finished. No banana, banana is not in the game yet, so it's not here. Bigger Beach is not out. Bigger Beach is rapidly approaching here, so yeah, that's happening at some point soon. I know the deadline internally, so that's interesting. But yeah. All this stuff is interesting and good to know. So yeah. I think this tier is good. So is there any issues anyone has with this tier list before we close off for today? I'm gonna put Durian S tier, but it's already an S tier, so it's not been, we can't really move it. Snapdragon is so bad. Yeah, actually, yeah. Uh, fair point, I'll move everything down. Snapdragon is just kinda crap. I say then I'll push up a plant here, that's not that bad. I'll put Blastberry in C. Blastberry's fine. Snapdragon just doesn't feel right to use, and it's a really difficult idea to use. I've never- I don't think it's been levels where I've really used Snapdragon well. I'll use it more later, it'll be fine, but for the time being, I think it's better. Gold should we see? We haven't really had a chance to use Gold, have we? Uh, new Mr. 2 is coming up, so we'll put it there later. Put it as Minter Whelm Face. Currently, it's in B tier, so meh. I think it's here is correct then. Uh, no plan D tier, I think he's moving. I think all these plants are in D tier for a good reason. I feel like Fire Peach is just a better Peapod outside from the case. I disagree. I think Peapod has the advantage of being much better early game. And I think you don't need that many Fire Peas. So I think it's good. Why is Roto so low? I can't use Roto. It's a personal list, so. Yeah. Flesh Peacher A? I don't think so. I think Flesh Peacher is solid B tier plant. While it can be good, it requires so many numbers to get really going that I don't think it's really out of the power, so I don't think it's an A tier. Like, every plant A tier is genuinely really reliable or good. Magni is Magni. Colonel is Colonel. Inferno is Inferno and is really strong. Repeater, Snow P and Peapod are all incredibly reliable attackers. Toadstool is basically unstoppable. Bong Choi is just insanely powerful. Hypno is a good early game, which I totally forgot about. Electric Current is Electric Current. S Word Loader is Exploring Nut. Kukwafer is a good early game. Aki is Aki. Just a solid around attacker. Holy Barry is decent overall. Good overall. And Slinky is Slinky. Chrono is running much up. I feel it's just because this level really did not let current stress work. It's my fault for trying to not make it work. What name is Magony? I don't think I might give it to use. It's fun to use, so I just don't use it. I get so many coins. I know you've been asking these questions for like 10 minutes, but like, there's nothing to really say. I just play the game. That's it. There's no trick to it, just play the game and do what the game tells you to do. But, yeah. I think it's about time we close off the stream then. It's been a good one. It's been a bit longer than I'd want to. It's 
went over like 20 minutes because we lost level twice and the stream didn't work and I am sorry for that. We had to start the stream twice and that screwed up this bloody beautiful playlist and that annoys me so much, but whatever. Either way, it's been a good time. I've enjoyed my time. Let's, next world is Need Mystic Tour. It is the last world. And I hope you're all looking forward to it. To it. So, yeah. And my phone is about to charge. Just on time. Just on cue. So, yeah. yeah it's, I guess it's time to close off. This has been Creeps. And have a good one.